It always feels right It don't cost nothing A beautiful life Make it mean something We gotta spread the love Spread the love Spread that love I'm starting to believe It's life changing Setting me free Love is waiting We gotta spread the love Spread the love Spread that love
morning everybody hello and welcome to my video my name is Deborah y'all are watching simply Deborah where I simply create content about what fashion beauty and everyday living beauty lifestyle beauty if today is your day that you would like to be a part of what we do come on and join hit that subscribe button don't forget to like share and comment and also if you returning hello hey welcome girl welcome back Thank you so much for coming back. I so greatly appreciated my lifestyle beauty. And also, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you're not already. Um, this morning, y'all saw me get up, get ready. And I am getting ready for my work day. It is 5.49. I still got a couple of minutes. As I sip on my caramel macchiato and eat my coffee cake that I just warmed up in the microwave. And... Uh, I'm getting ready to get this day started. How's everybody doing? Today is Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. Yesterday I had so many difficulties with my system. Oh my God. It was all jacked up. But we're believing that today is going to be a better day. I've been editing a, a video all week. I've been stopping looking at Kyra and low key skipping through her video. But y'all, I'm going to go ahead and get to work. 6.51. 6.51, so I am getting ready to finish my breakfast, and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. Good morning, Lifestyle Beauties, and welcome back to my channel. Today is Friday. Hello and welcome. Um, if you're not already, I hope today will be the day that you will become a part of our family. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button right down below. And if you are returning, hello, hey, welcome, and thank you so much for coming back. I so greatly appreciate it. Guys, today is Friday. Just went and got my Starbucks. It is 6.53. So I got a couple of minutes before I actually start work. Got my Starbucks and my coffee cake. And I think the last day I left off was last Friday. Or no, it was actually uh, it was actually on the last day I left off was Wednesday. So today is Friday and today I get off early. So I'm gonna start the weekend vlog now. And I'm gonna eat, drink my coffee. My coffee cake. Mm. I'll chat with y'all in a minute. Bye. Hey guys, hello. Welcome back, my lifestyle beauties. Good afternoon. Yeah, good evening. <laughs> good evening. It is 3.22. So today is Friday. I got off of work, took a bath because I was so hot. Y'all, it is 85 here. Alexa, what is the temperature here in Palm Bay, Florida? Right now, it's 83 degrees Fahrenheit. Tonight, expect a low of 75 degrees. 83. So, I was hot. I got off work, took a bath, and I am actually getting ready to go to Target, waiting on my husband to come home. But, yeah, y'all. I am, so I get up at 5 o'clock in the morning, as y'all saw in my previous video. Now it's just me and y'all. <laughs> I'm actually waiting on my husband. We're getting ready to go to Target. So waiting on him to come home. Got off of work. Had to take a bath. And now I feel so much better. I love using these combos for my lips. I just think it just adds, oh, look at my bun, y'all. She falling down again. But I just love that for my lips. So um, I just got off work and let me put some more of this on. This is the Lip Glow Oil from Dior. 
and I absolutely love it and I use it with this Kosas. So I think it brings out like the pink tint in my lips. Um, yeah, but I'm just getting off work, waiting on my husband to come home. Today is Friday. Happy Friday, y'all. We are going into the weekend. Do you guys have anything planned for the weekend? I don't have much planned myself, but yeah. But guys, so I know y'all saw my previous clips. So I get up at five o'clock in the morning. I don't have to be to work until seven. So I know some of y'all are probably saying, well, why do you get up so early? I normally, I get up at five so that I can take my bath, put on clean clothes, do my makeup. If I'm going to do any makeup, just do a simple look. Um, and I like going out, going to Target, or not to Target, but to Starbucks in the morning, grabbing me a skinny caramel macchiato. I love that for me because it allows me to get out. It allows me to have that Zen time before work just to get out. I work from home, so that allows me to get out and just get in the mix and feel like I'm doing something. So I love getting up, going out, getting my Starbucks in the morning. I do buy my Starbucks from Target, but they don't have them in the skinny anymore. They used to sell them skinny, but they don't have that anymore. I don't know why, but if Starbucks, if you're listening, if y'all can help me to like persuade them to bring it back, I would greatly appreciate it. But yeah, so I love the Starbucks skinny. The Starbucks regular really do not agree with my tummy. I can't drink coffee or anything like that. Like, uh, I don't know. It just messed my stomach up, girl. But the skinny caramel macchiato, I can deal with all day long. It does not mess with my stomach. And I just love that for me. So it allows me, like I said, by me getting up at five and getting myself together, that just allowed me a little time to myself, which I'm at home all day by myself. But that allows me to get out and just know that the world is still moving. <laughs> the world is still going around. So yeah, so I love that for me. I'm a morning person. I love getting things done early in the morning. I hate waiting around to do anything. If I'm going to do something, I'm going to get up early that morning and do it. So I'm the type of person is I do my best in the morning, y'all. Because when that afternoon, evening fall around, your girl is... is, is she moving kind of slow. She's moving kind of slow. So I do that. I this Today I had me my caramel macchiato. I had a coffee cake, which I'm trying to wing myself off of the coffee cakes again. And uh, for lunch, I did eat a bagel because I was kind of a little bit hungry. I had got these like double baked mashed potato. Um, they're like mashed potatoes, but they're still in the skin. So I got those from Market Fresh. I put those on because I, I always wanted to know how they taste. One year, my, uh, my company gave a Christmas party and we had some and they were so good. That was the first time I had ever tasted them. And it's been years, y'all, years. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to get these from Market Fresh and see if they taste, you know, somewhat similar. At that time, I was eating like bacon and everything, so it was like fully loaded. So yeah, this one, not so much. Fridays used to care, make some good ones, uh, but yeah. So I got the two, they came in, they come in a pack of two or one, but I got the pack of two and I put those on for lunch and I was like, I'm just gonna, you know, see how they taste. Although I had already ate my bagel, so I wasn't trying to eat all of that. So I did taste them. They were okay, but they did have salt on it. I try to limit my salt intake. I don't have diabetes or anything like that. So, but I just, a lot of salt is not good for you. I don't want it either. So I try to limit my intake of salt. A lot of salt makes my head spin. And so that, you could taste the salt in it. I don't think it had a lot, but you could definitely taste little specks of salt in it. I think they sprinkle salt on top of it. And so by it being on top, you can definitely taste it. So, but anywho, it was, they were okay. I only tasted, I only took like maybe three bites, small bites uh, with a fork out of it and then um, end up throwing them in the garbage. <laughs> but they were okay. They were okay. 
Uh, would I buy them again? Absolutely. And this time I would probably fix them with a meal. But I wanted to cook them because I didn't want them to go bad. I had actually brought them on Monday. Today is Friday. So I was like, girl, you better cook those or else they're going to be going in the garbage. Do y'all do that a lot? Buy items, quick fast foods that you're like, okay, I'm going to make during the week. And then during the week come and buy it before you know it, it's Friday. And it's just like, oh my God. I forgot to make it just like I got some vegetables in there that I picked up from Market Fresh and it was $10. So I hate the fact that they might go bad and they got like garlic butter in it and you kind of like saute it and I want to make them, but I don't want them for dinner tonight. <laughs> so, oh my God. Oh my God. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. She say she ain't legally blind no more. <laughs> Y'all, same day, just different top. <laughs> I had to change my top because I got so hot. Oh my God. I had to put on a top that I can move around in a little bit. Because that Skims top was like, no way. Mm -mm. Get somebody else to do it. I got this top from... Um, I got this top from, what's the name of that company? Timu. Yep. Got this top from Timu. I'm just waiting on my husband, y'all. So as soon as he get here, that was my daughter calling. And I did fix my bun as well because your girl was looking raggedy. So I'm just waiting on my husband to come so that we can go out. So I'll see y'all at Target. Bye. Hey guys, just got back from Target. I left my camera at home. I was like, what? Got out, got to the store. I'm like, where is my camera? And I left y'all right here. So I'm gonna do a quick haul on everything that I got. <clears throat> I got some avocado oil. I think I'm gonna try these. They're called Spanco, Spancopita. They're Greek inspired phyllo pastry with the spinach and feta cheese filling. I love spinach and feta cheese. So I was like, and then you put it in the air fryer. So I'm going to try that. Green tea, unsweetened um, vegetables, broccoli and cauliflower, a margarita pizza, four things of water, a starburst, just something to. I got my gluten free pancakes, some foil because we were running low. My husband got some lightly salted chips. Water. Water. I love these. Do y'all like these? Some gum, m and for peanuts. I picked up some Starb I mean some uh, Lifesavers. Some mouthwash. Picked up some Windex wipes. We needed some palm olive. Got some bath soap, fabric beads. Oh, I've been working out and my thighs hurt so bad. Okay, I'll talk with y'all later. Bye. Good morning, guys. Hello and happy Monday. How is everybody doing? Hope everybody is doing well, y'all. This was supposed to have been a weekend vlog, but I did not do anything this weekend. So, it is not. I actually brought these headbands this weekend, though. We went, like, normal, like, you know, the grocery shopping and... All of that stuff. I did wash a couple of wigs that I want to put on for this week. Um, but other than that, girl, we really did not do anything this weekend. Watch Netflix the whole weekend. Um, I added a video that I need to get up. And yeah, I'm just straightening up because I actually need to go get a car wash. So I'm just straightening up a little bit, not much. But a little bit. Y'all, this weekend was the first time I wore my Crocs. I've never worn them since I got them. They're these pink little Crocs. Um, love, love, love. If y'all wear Crocs, comment down below. Let me know. <laughs> so this weekend, girl, all I did was grocery shopping. We cleaned up the house. And that was it. Today, I am... Making my husband a roast. He wanted a roast. I'm like, I eat very, very, very light during the week. 
So I'm like, I can make you something that you can eat off the week. <laughs> so that was our plan and he wanted a roast. So that is what I will be making him for dinner. I will probably put that on at about 12.30. It's 10.30 now, a little bit after 10.30. And I'm gonna get a car wash and then come home. But we picked these up from Walmart. And this is for the trick-or-treaters. We have Kit Kat, Reese's, uh, Pops, Tussie Roll Pops, Tussie Roll Candy. And I will put these in a bag. I picked up these bags from the Birthday Owl. Um, there's some treat bags with the twist ties in it. They come in a pack of 20. They were a dollar. So I'll make 40 of those, which I thought was good. I have my scissors here to open up that. So I have a few dishes that I will wash when I get back because I want to hurry up and get to this car wash. Um, give me some coffee and head back home. So that is all we are going to do today. Not much. Grab my phone. But let me put my gym shoes on so we can go. And I'll chat with y'all in the car. on these green cargo pants that I picked up from Target. They kind of like the workout. I found these in the workout section. They have just a pocket right here with a zip on each side. They do have a drawstring. I have on a simple black t-shirt that I picked up probably from Target as well. And I have on this black button up top um, that I actually got from Fashion Nova. Okay, y'all, we're getting ready to head out. Oh my God, I smell so good. My scent for today is Jimmy Choo. And Rihanna has a fragrance out that I got. It smells so good, I have to get it. But whatever the scent is by Rihanna, I have to get that. And yeah, so that is it. So we're gonna head out. We're gonna turn the alarm on. And then go get a car wash. It's looking like it's gonna rain, but. We'll see, people. We'll see. I need to eat. Disarmed. Ready to arm. Time. So let's go. So, as I was saying, I only got 39 minutes on here, so we're going to hurry up and do what we have to do and get back home. Boot, um, lifestyle beauties. So... As I was saying, so I thought I cleaned up my house this week and apparently, or this weekend, but apparently I have stuff like everywhere. I was just walking through and I'm like, oh my God, I cleaned up this weekend. It don't even look like it. Well, this weekend we absolutely did not do anything. I feel like my house stay the cleanest when we're not in it. <laughs> when we're in it, life be lifing and it's like things get set in places that they don't belong and yeah it just becomes a mess so i actually have to finish washing because i did not finish washing i'm gonna cook dinner for my husband today yesterday we just ate a pizza from pizza hut and went grocery shopping didn't do like i said didn't do a lot got the same old normal stuff that y'all always see me get so there was no reason to do a haul or any of that so i didn't and so yeah so today I'm going to get a car wash and then I'm going to Starbucks, come back home. I'm going to put my husband roast on at about probably 12.30, slow cook it. And then I am going to come back home and what am I gonna do? Come back home, I need to make the bags for the trick-or-treaters. 
Tomorrow is Halloween, right? Is tomorrow the 31st? What's today? Today's the 30th. Oh my God, and tomorrow's the 31st. Okay, so yeah. So, got to get that together. And then I, I should have, if I had been thinking about it, sent my grandkids a little trick-or-treat package. Uh, and I should have been like, did that last week where they would get it today or tomorrow. Darn it, that would have been so cute. So next year, that's my goal. <laughs> next year, that is my goal to do that. <clears throat> but this trick or treat, this Halloween, unfortunately, I dropped the bomb on that. That would have been so bomb if I had to did that too. They would have so enjoyed that. But oh well, can't go back, right? Tomorrow is Halloween, so there's no way I can get anything today and they have it tomorrow. So sorry babes so anyway so there goes that so now i'm getting ready like i said to go to the car wash and just go to starbucks and come back home not doing anything exciting so this weekend y'all if y'all have okay so i watch housewives of potomac i know they're not out yet i am the number one fan when it comes to ratchiness tv love 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 so I look at Housewives of Potomac. So Housewives of Potomac, Giselle and um, Giselle and um, what is her name? Giselle and oh my God, I can't think of it. They have a podcast, and in their podcast, they always do like shady moments. So I thought that was so cute. So I think that that is something. I just start watching them, and I kind of like been binge watching them. Or listening to the podcast and so Giselle Bryant and that's her name Robin and Giselle they have a podcast and it's called reasonably shady and I listened to it I just started listening to it so I kind of been binge watching them so they have a thing on their uh, segment on their show which is called shady moments so I was like how cool is that for me to incorporate into our videos why are all the cows laying down today Normally they're up eating. They're all laying down. Oh my God. I have not saw them lay down like that. I mean like they're just like laying down. <laughs> they must be tired or do I not come out? Well, I'm normally not out during this time of the day. But so they have a segment. That's what I forgot me some Kleenex. They have a segment on their show which is called Reasonably Shady shady moments so I was like how cool is that to incorporate that into our video right um, like on a weekly like on my weekend vlogs or my Tuesday vlogs that I normally upload Tuesday or Wednesday I'm like I'm gonna start incorporating that so I'm gonna start speaking it like on Mondays so we got to think of a shady moment and I want y'all to comment down below with a shady moment a shady moment is somebody that did something shady it doesn't matter who it is, but you just, you know, just giving your shady moment. So that is what we're going to start doing, incorporating it. And yes, I did steal it from Robin and Giselle. So what is y'all shady moment of the week? Do I know y'all have one because I have one. So we are going to get into our shady moment. So guys, my shady moment for the week is my shady of the my shady moment of the week goes to my husband yes my husband the reason being that he was just like so he always complained it's too hot i mean it's too cold in the house that i have the ac on for a blast i get hot really 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 quick and it's just like a, a heat that i don't know it's hard to explain but I get hot super duper quick so I keep my temperature in the home and it's not even like really cold I keep it set on 74 very 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 rarely do I drop it below 74 I mean I really gotta be hot but I normally keep it at 74 when it's not hot outside when it's like in the low 70s or high 70s low 80s I try to keep it up to maybe I try to turn it off actually and just like have the fans on in the house 
So he was talking about how hot it was or how cold it was outside. I mean, in the house. He was talking about how cold it was in the house. So he asked me to come outside to help him do some stuff. So I was like, sure. So I went outside, helped him did that. It was a beautiful breeze yesterday. It was so nice. And the breeze was hitting just right. It was like, yes, you know, finally it's, it's cooling off a little bit. And it was just windy. It just felt super duper good, y'all, outside. So I was like, okay, so... I'm like, well, what I'm going to do is go in there and turn the AC down because he's always complaining that it's too cold in the house. So I went in the house, cleaned out the windows because our screen for our windows, the screen holes is not tiny, 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 tiny. It's still big enough that little, little bugs can get through. And I hate bugs. I hate bugs. But I was like... I'm gonna go in there, I'm gonna clean out all the windows, get out, suck out all the bugs with the vacuum, and then go behind it and wipe it all out, which I did. I went, I cleaned out all the windows, I took the vacuum and I vacuumed out all the little bugs that was in there, took some wipes and wiped everything down, the window pane and all of that. It looks really nice, super duper clean. So then I was like, it was a nice breeze. I was like, well, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna go take a bath. And I'm gonna put on some shorts and I'm gonna turn on every fan in this house and I should be okay so I did that took a bath put on some shorts a little t-shirt and opened up the windows well when I opened up the windows guess who come in the house and close the windows mr. C talking about it's the bugs are getting in the house I'm like are you kidding me you the one who sit here and complain all day long that I have the AC on and that I can turn it off. Then when I turn it off, you talking about it's the bugs. Well, Mr. C, you got to give somewhere. You can't have it both your way. This ain't Burger King. Now, you ain't finna have me up in the house with the windows down, the AC off, is burning up in the house. No. So, he gets the shady flag for the day, y'all. He gets the shady moment of the day. I was like, really? You do all this complaining. I clean out the window sills, open up the windows for the nice breeze can come in, turn the AC off, turned on all the fans. It was feeling good in there. I was catching a vibe. And he was like, it's too many bugs. Bugs are on the screen, on the window pane. I was like, are you kidding me? I'm like, okay. So he get that shady moment for the day, y'all. So yes. So the shady moment goes to my husband for the week. So what I want y'all to do is comment down below and give me a shady moment. Something that happened in your week that pertained to somebody, to something, to somewhere where you were at, somewhere where somebody get that shady moment of the day. And comment down below. I would love to hear from y'all and we just going to laugh and just keep this fun and just, um, just, yeah, love on one another. I thought that would be good to incorporate into my videos guys so yeah so and another thing so we've been binge watching Netflix if y'all and I'm not one for TV so this weekend I started out watching I love love stories so I started out watching love stories then it went from love stories to Christmas love stories so I was into it then I clicked on something and I was thinking, okay, it's just the, um, it's just another, you know, movie, Netflix movie. Well, it was a Netflix, Netflix movie that has series to it. It had a series of, I think, six or seven. I think it was seven movies to it. So I think it was, yeah, I think it was six or seven. But anyway, y'all, the name of the movie, oh my God, it was so good. And, okay, so... I have to so the name of the movie was um, well, the name of the movie was from scratch y'all it's a Netflix series and when I tell y'all it is so good it is so freaking good I swear I don't know if Netflix movies get Oscars but that movie demand an Oscar it was amazing. The cast in it was Iguano Mastrandria. 
I don't know, I'm probably bashing his name, but he looked like he's an Italian. He was supposed to be a Sicilian. He might be Sicilian. Um, he was a Sicilian in the movie. Zoe Saldana was in it. Um, who else was in it? Um, it had a really lot of good actors in it. But y'all, but when I tell y'all that movie, oh my God, it had you happy in the beginning. It had you so in love with the characters. It. My husband never, ever cries in a movie. My husband cried in this movie, y'all. He actually cried tears. I'm usually the crier. I'm usually crying and just like, give me a box of Kleenex. And girl, that movie was awesome. Oh my God, it was so awesome. So I definitely recommend that. If you're not doing anything on the weekend, when you're laying in the bed, I definitely think that that's a movie that you definitely want to put on and watch. That movie was so good. Oh, my God. I don't want to give it away. We'll talk about it next week on, on, on here. And I'll let you guys watch it first and then let me know what you guys think. And then we could talk about it together. So I don't want to be a movie spoiler, so I'm going to let y'all watch it first, and then we'll talk about it next week. But, oh my God, that movie was so freaking good. So make sure y'all watch it, and then we'll chat on it next week. So, yes, how about that? So, yeah. So I don't have anything else going on other than that, guys. And, yeah. So I'll talk to y'all in a minute. Hey y'all, so the car wash has been suckered. I think it's Badcock. I think that's the street I want to go down. Because I think they have a Starbucks right here. So I got the car wash done. <clears throat> I'm actually on my way back home. I keep forgetting here is so different from the city that they don't pull out to the intersection when the light is green they pull and turn once there's no cars coming which is so different from Chicago from Chicago we pull in the intersection when the light is red or green and car on ongoing cars are coming we um, then once the cars have you know stopped then you have the right away but here they all oh, snap here they don't do that here they don't do that they just good morning or good afternoon may I have a venti um, skinny caramel macchiato with extra caramel drizzle this is hot or it's hot venti hot skinny caramel macchiato you said extra caramel drizzle yes fantastic anything else yep and do you have any coffee cakes I think I do do you want it warm um nope you could just leave it in the bag that'll be fine the plastic love to see it Else? That'll be all. Awesome. Thank you. Awesome. 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 I have to get my window clean again. I have to let it down. Hello. Hello. Okay. For some reason, my screen just went dark. Let me see. Oh, here we go. I don't know why I keep doing that. Enough stars to get your items for free today. Would you like to use them? Uh, yeah, that's fine. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Of course. Sometimes it's just one of those days. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Here's that coffee. Alrighty, sounds good. Hey, you didn't spend another, so there you go. <laughs> cool. Thank you. Can I have a stopper? You sure can. Thanks. Sounds good. Thank you. Well, Okay, guys, so I didn't have to use any money because I had Starbucks money. So that's the best Starbucks in the world. 
So now we're headed home, boo. Now we're headed home, babes. So I will check y'all at home. Peace, love, and hair grease. <laughs> Peace, love, and hair grease. Okay, I'll chat with y'all. Hey, Lifestyle Beauty. So I just made it home. OMG. It's the worst when you have an alarm set in your house and you have to potty. And it's like the alarm is going off. You're trying to pee. It's like, give me a minute, please. Oh, my God. Mm. But I'm at home. Get ready to eat my coffee cake. Put my husband roast on. And straighten up a little bit.
forget to show y'all Din Din. <laughs> After all of that, uh, my husband have already eaten, but here is the remnants of it. It is pot roast and the potatoes, and I have onions and carrot slices in there. And these are the sweet potatoes. So I did eat sweet potatoes, and I ate the carrots and the potatoes. He had the meat, so and it was yummy 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 so i think he said he finna take a nap that's why i don't eat meat <laughs> it does a number on the body but i am going to go ahead and close out this video because i'm not going to do anything else for today um probably i'll come back tomorrow which will probably be a new video with the trick-or-treaters and all of that but yeah so i'm going to go ahead and close out this was like a little simple weekend continuation from last week kind of type vlog <laughs> so if you're new to my channel hello girl hope you will become a part of what i do lifestyle beauty and become one of my lifestyle beauties and hit that subscribe button and you have just joined the family if you are returning hello hey welcome and thank you so much for coming back i so greatly appreciate it i know we have covered so much in this video but i do i do i do i appreciate all the love i appreciate you guys just looking at my video and just yeah just experiencing life with me as i life and you life and we life in together <laughs> and i appreciate that guys um truly from my heart to your heart i really 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 appreciate all of you guys though and i am going to go ahead and close out this video so don't forget to like share subscribe and comment down below subscribing is a big thing liking is even bigger because it pushes my video in the algorithm and it pushes it to other people so that they can see it so i appreciate all the likes i appreciate all the comments don't forget guys to put your shady moment down below can't wait to read those and yeah and i'm gonna go ahead and go and i will talk to y'all in my next video so until then love peace and happiness Mwah. bye